guys, we have made it. We have made it to the last game of the NFL season. It is Super Bowl 58 between the Kansas City Cheaters and the San Francisco 49ers, guys. We made it, bruh. It's been a long ass year, bruh. Chiefs, they weren't supposed to make the Super Bowl. They made it anyway. The Baltimore Ravens literally had their best season in their franchise's history and still can get the job done. The Detroit Lions, ladies and gentlemen, the Detroit Lions made the conference championship, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Never, I would never, ever, ever thought I would say that the Detroit Lions almost made the Super Bowl. In my lifetime, I never thought I'd say that, bro, for real. Bro, it was just so much craziness this season. The Cowboys still being the Cowboys, you know, Jordan Love is that guy. Anyway, 49ers and the Chiefs, bro. I know y'all been waiting for my Super Bowl pick, my Super Bowl prediction, and it's going to be fairly simple. Why not we go with the Kansas City Chiefs, you know what I'm saying? It's Kansas City Chiefs, Patrick Mahomes, Travis Kelsey, the Swifties, you know what I'm saying? The Chiefs, they always been in the Super Bowl. They've been Super Bowl like four of the last five years, you know what I'm saying? Why not go for the Kansas City? Nope. Let's look at the San Francisco 49ers. Brock Purdy, George Kittle, Debo Samuel, CMC. That defense... Boy, this is going to be a hard Super Bowl pick. I ain't going to lie. Oh, no, I know, I know, I know that Patrick Mahomes and the Kansas City Chiefs have literally been on a tear this postseason, bro. When the, when the Chiefs first made the postseason, nobody, and I mean nobody, picked the Chiefs to go to the Super Bowl. Nobody did. Not even me. Nobody. Nobody picked the Chiefs to go to the Super Bowl because... The receivers, they were dropping the ball. Patrick Mahomes looked human for the first time in like four or five years. Really, first time in his whole career. Travis Kelsey wasn't really balling like how he used to. Darius Tony literally fumbled the greatest play of all time. And ever since then, the Chiefs have been falling. Nobody picked him to make the Super Bowl. Um, as far as the 49ers go, they started off hot in the season. Then they started losing like three or four straight games or something like that. And then they came right back up and they got smacked by Baltimore really, really, really bad. And, bro, ever since then, bro, the 49ers have been on a mission. Brock Purdy, honestly, he is starting to become like a system quarterback in my eyes, bro. Because, bro, these playoffs, Brock Purdy has not even played well, bro. And they've still won every single one. I ain't gonna lie, they almost lost to Green Bay, though. Imagine Jordan Love in the Super Bowl. That would've been crazy. I know y'all want my Super Bowl pick. And this year, my Super Bowl 58 winner is the San Francisco 49ers. The Chiefs have been dangerous in the playoffs, bro. But, bro, the 49ers look like they coming for vengeance, bro. They, bro, they the visions right now, bro. They trying to win the joint, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Remember that clip? I know y'all seen that clip. It's been surfacing over the internet. Remember in the first Super Bowl between the Chiefs and the Niners. Remember the 2021, no, no, 2019 Super Bowl. Remember the 2019 Super Bowl when uh, the 49ers lost and George Kittle was talking about how he's going to come back and come back with vengeance? Bruh, I think George Kittle about to come back and have like 200 yards, bruh. <laughs> Bro, you just got to think about it, bruh. The 49ers are literally on a mission. Brock Purdy is literally the last pick of the draft. He's going to prove everybody wrong. He's going to be the first, last pick to ever win the Super Bowl, bro. He's going to make history. Yeah, I got the 49ers, bro. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe for more NFL, NBA content. I'm out. Shout out, gang.